So we're on day 16, imagine 16 days, 16 herbs. Well, we've got 30 days and I'm bringing you 30 herbs for better mental health in 30 days. And on day 16, I'm bringing you rosemary, very much associated with cooking and especially Spanish cooking, but it's also associated with brain and improving memory and concentration and particularly good around strams, ex exams, strams, exams. So rosemary, remember it's a simple one for quick uh, treatment of boosting memory and concentration around stressful times like exams or doing a driving test or an interview or whatever it is you need to do. Uh, rosemary is that quick herb that can help you deal with that situation. So traditionally rosemary has been used to strengthen the memory and boost the ability to concentrate and focus and it's particularly good for boosting you around exam time and dealing with the exhaustion that comes with exams and worry and stress and all of that. So a particular mental health issue that affects a lot of younger people in particular and older people because learning is for life and I'm sure a lot of people are engaged in lifelong learning. The part used is the leaf and it can form the essential oil, rosemary, the essential oil is a very good oil to use externally as well but I'm talking about the use internally today which is the, the dried leaf uh, used as an infusion or also as a tincture. Three main actions are it's an anti-inflammatory, it's a digestive and it's a nervine tonic. There's an emerging theory that a lot of diseases are caused by inflammation. So if you have an anti-inflammatory, an actual anti-inflammatory like rosemary, uh, turmeric is another fantastic one, but naturally in anti-inflammatories are gonna protect you from many, many diseases. There's even an idea that uh, mental health diseases of the brain, including depression, are also affected by inflammation in the brain. So rosemary works in that way by reducing the inflammation and uh, allowing the brain to restore its natural balance, and in this case, improve its ability to concentrate and focus and improve memory. Rosemary can also be used in the treatment of headaches associated with tension or stress, and both can be used internally and externally. The oil can be used in a carrier oil and just massaged around the, the temple there, the forehead, and, uh, and just breathe in the lovely aromas of rosemary and uh, have a nice rosemary tea and uh, you can be guaranteed your stress will reduce and you will be able to focus better. Rosemary is a great herb also for digestion and digestion as we know is a key part of mental health. Good digestion brings about good mental health and the production of serotonin. So that's it for this video. I hope you've enjoyed this video about rosemary and uh, if you want to support my channel remember give this video a like, share it on social media and other platforms and subscribe if you haven't for weekly content. And I look forward to seeing you in a video tomorrow. Take care. Bye-bye.